An abortion bill on the governor's desk could become the strictest in the country. KNWA's Katie Davila is live in studio with what Northwest Arkansas lawmakers are saying about the bill. And Katie, this is making history. Yeah, Jennifer, that's right. The proposed bill would make it illegal to have an abortion after a woman is 18 weeks pregnant. Organizations in the natural state are fighting to stop it from becoming law. And we do want to warn you some of the images that you will see may be disturbing for some viewers. With a 77 to 13 vote, the Arkansas House pushed forward a bill restricting women from getting an abortion if they're past 18 weeks pregnant, except in cases of rape, incest, or medical emergencies. I think this is a step in the right direction. Representative Robin Lundstrom sponsored the bill, saying the state should make a stronger stance on abortions. I think it's time to make a statement that we are pro-life. Four and a half months is halfway through the pregnancy. Uh, the baby is fully formed, pain capable. All the organ systems are there and fully formed. So I think law needs to catch up with the science. Once signed by Governor Asa Hutchinson, the bill would make Arkansas the third state to restrict abortion 18 weeks after fertilization, joining Mississippi and North Carolina. I wish abortion weren't out there. That's no secret, but I think this is a, a logical step. Members of the Arkansas chapter of the American Civil Liberties Union are ready to fight back, saying this is a new low for politicians. Their executive director saying Arkansas lawmakers are trampling on the Constitution and putting the health of Arkansans at risk. This bill is dangerously extreme and similar to laws that have been blocked by courts here in Arkansas and other states. But this is the first time a baby was photographed live inside the womb. If the bill is passed, the ACLU says they will file suit against the state. Other abortion measures are advancing in the natural state, including a proposal to prohibit doctors from performing abortion solely due to a Down syndrome diagnosis. And that was endorsed by the Senate Wednesday afternoon. Live in studio, Katie Davila, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.